We are Cindy and Eddie. And this is Squeeze the Day. Seattle, our home for the next adventure. Whenever we go out to a new place, we always ask the question, why are we going here? You have to ask yourself, why would you want to visit Seattle? This is our first video explaining why we're here, and we hope you can find a reason for a visit too. We originally came out to Seattle following the Graduate Hotels Hall Pass. Check out that adventure as we explore 30 hotels in 30 days and post each one daily. Because neither one of us have ever been here before, we are really curious about what makes this city so amazing. And I think we're starting to see why. We're going to the beach. This little one just had some food and water. She is ready for a nap. All tuckered out, aren't you, Lou? Today we are at Snoqualmie Falls Park. These falls are near Seattle, Washington. We are returning to our normal adventures, traveling with a cat. We're gonna be taking the cat with us. As we check out these falls, and we're taking you along as well, let's go. When you arrive, Google's going to send you to a paid parking lot. If you go to the other side of the road, there is a free parking lot. You simply walk across the overhead bridge and you can visit this for free. Once you've got your bearings, simply walk from that board we just showed you out to the waterfalls, passing by a couple of seating areas and displays to get to this lookout point. We took a couple minutes for ourselves to enjoy that view, so we're going to leave this right here for you so you can enjoy it too. But keep in mind, it's so much better in person. What do you think, Lulu? I'm pretty sure right now she's thinking about a nap. But then again, she might be having a curiosity of a cat. And now for the fun part. This trail is a half mile downhill. At least the trees are beautiful. Well, these ones anyway. These pine trees are so tall too. Another little picnic area at the bottom of the hill. Just keep following the signs and learn a little bit about why this is here along the way. Part of the educational process is learning what water turbines are for and how they generate electricity. Pretty cool. A lot of work went into preparing a path that was safe for everybody to follow, so make sure you stay on the path, but still enjoy the view along the way. Also keep in mind that wood does get slippery when wet, so still be careful. This is the magnificent view from the bottom. Again, just take a moment to enjoy this, but remember it's always better in person. Even Cinders was having a good time here. 
Now we did say it was a half mile downhill climb. It felt like it was three going up. It was very steep, but wow. that's pretty big. Lou has been to some amazing places, hasn't she? We had fun along the way and after our 30 days of intense road travel, we we're definitely ready for some exploration. Sometimes pictures don't really show you the actual skill of something. So I just wanted to show you guys that that's downhill. It was a good hike. We're sweating now. And we did take the cat, check out those pictures. Uh, we hope you like the shots. We uh, hope you enjoyed walking along with us. Before we go any further, we also would like to mention how cute this town is. They've got all these historic, they might be rusted, but beautiful trains right on the outskirts of it. And if you walk through the town, it's really got one of those classic hometown, tiny town feels to it that, you know, we love. Realistically, the whole area is beautiful. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications so you can continue to follow along as we continue to adventure with our cat. And as always, squeeze the day and be well.